Okay, so guys, let's continue the music. <laughs> Emma, why are you being so uh, <laughs> modest? <laughs> we need to, yeah. to hear some more singing. And I think the best person to follow up because some, some of us will probably want to sing one or two things, the Christ is risen. You know, just continue the, um, uh, the good feelings. But I think you, you should definitely be the ones following um, uh, the amazing uh, Georgian band so what do you say <laughs> give it a try <laughs> we, yeah i mean i don't know how many excuses we should give before we do <laughs> but um, we've already have many excuses and then <laughs> we've already established they are out of this world so <laughs> yeah, yeah, us yeah. us the the in this world we can <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> well we we just um we just uh, prepared a song which is quite a popular song, a uh, Greek song, but we sort of have a folky version of it to sing. Mm -hmm. And we, uh, yeah, maybe you can translate the, the, the chorus what? of it. Okay, what's the song about? Um, the chorus of the songs is talking about uh, the, mm, the persistence. <laughs> The persistence, the name of the song is The Persistence. And it says that uh, to someone else, maybe someone you love or to Christ even, you can say that what great strength your strength gives to me. Uh, as you say that everything will be done. And I hear this voice from you. Uh, yeah, and then it is repeated in, in the different order. And anything yeah. any other nice lines to translate? Um, That's the gist of yeah. it, but should we move the chair back? I think we're quite looking forward. We should. We should. Yeah, it's okay, it's okay. Right, so I She was watching. She was watching in Limassol the festival yesterday, and we brought her over to Miss Nicosia. Oh, <laughs> no. What is happening? I thought you you just basically got out of one account and arrived in Cyprus. <laughs> I thought you were in the UK. Uh, <laughs> Well, that's very nice to see all of yeah. you. So we have Milto, we have Emma, and Mario, and Harry. Yeah, yeah so, so, so I joined the, 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 the Cyprus team. <laughs> who, who used to live uh, in the UK? I know Emma used to live in the UK, Harry used to live in the UK. And, and Milto. No, yeah, we and live in Cyprus. Who used to? I used to live in the UK, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So everyone is moving to We all used to be in the UK and we used to live in Scotland. Yeah. London. Okay. I'm at my bath, so we, we live the same place. Yeah. Okay. Can you hear the guitar? Yes.
That was amazing. Thank you. Also, <laughs> Harry stealing the show with a show of hands, says James. <laughs> Harry, I've got to hand it to you. He's very grateful. Yeah. <laughs> it He's was very handy. <laughs> bravo, guys. Bravo, guys. Hello, <laughs> Harry. <laughs> Tim is saying, Polio Rea. Mu apresi musikieri niki. Beautiful, I love Greek music. Yeah. <laughs> we all love Greek music and I think Cyprus is inspiring you, so we want to hear more. <laughs> oh, okay. Alexa. No, we can do, yeah. I don't know, yeah. Final words. Final words. I mean, dude, we can actually dance on my piano. Yes. We can try, but then yeah. we'd have to move that up for around. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, <laughs> we can have a full performance with dance as well. This is amazing. Maybe you can move the tree. It's a power to last long enough as well. Yeah, I think. Sorry. <laughs> uh, yeah. 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 Oh. 
I remember when I tried to sing it with the choir at some point with you guys, but it wasn't yeah. definitely this fun version. Yeah. Okay. Nero is water, right? Yeah. So you should. So the song overall for the non-Greek speakers. Well, to be honest, we didn't actually say the correct author because I found like wrong lyrics, so we're <laughs> improvising in the way. But actually, the song what it says is about like people that. Um, it, it actually is, is about uh, a woman which is waiting for her a man who's a sailor to return uh, back. And it's like the song is talking to the sea and it's saying to the sea, please do not bring him back and do not um, be uh, hard to the man because the woman is young and we want him back. Because it's like, it's a story like uh, that it reminds like uh, uh, the Greeks like in, in like uh, old times, like there were so many sailors and there were so many young women that they were using their uh, husbands at very young ages. So uh, the song is like talking about, is talking to the sea, uh, to the sea and asking the sea to bring him back safe. That is beautiful and touching. And I want more of that. <laughs> Who, because we don't want to take up who has other something to. I think you, to Cyprus. I think you guys are uh, basically the um, the entertaining oh. uh, group uh, for the next no. uh, fifteen oh, no. minutes. No. <laughs> no. Take some jokes if you want, my I'd, love to be able to be able to sing. I'd actually love to be able to sing with you, uh, all of you, all four of you, uh, but I don't know if there's going to be a bit of a delay here in the UK if I if I sing something and then you play and it happens. Like, you can't have a It could be a form of alternative singing, maybe. Um, possibly. Right, I'm going to sing a, a couple of songs. I, I haven't, my violin's downstairs and I haven't actually practiced it in a while. So I think if I actually played it along with anything, I'd probably do, uh, I'd probably be a bit of a misjustice, to be honest. So I'm going to try and rely on my voice, even though my voice hasn't been the most reliable thing in the last uh, few years of my life, shall we just say. I'm at first going to sing what is uh, something from Crete. And this song is called Oso Varunda Sidera. So it's how way the iron's uh, way. So it's, uh, if you look at the lyrics, it's actually not a particularly happy um, song. But then again, that's pretty much the same with all Greeks and Becky as well. And everyone dances at weddings to them perfectly fine. You'll know, you'll know what I mean if you ever get there. So I'll, um, I'll do my best to give my, the best take on this that I feel like I've heard. And I'll see if I can translate this uh, well. <clears throat> um, uh, oh, so varun da si manaman varun da Oh, 
με ψεύτη κόσμο. Να μην κοιτάζω. Okay, so that's the first one. Beautiful. Thank you. I did not hear you before singing such songs, and I confess I also want more. <laughs> uh, well, I, the next one I'm going to do, so this is, I've only kind of prepared two things. Um, the next one, I don't, I'd actually really like if Harry and Emma could play to this, but I don't know if they actually can, as I said, because of the sound delay. And this is uh, Milo Mugokino, and I think Emma and Harry remember this very, very well. If they're not in their heads, do you remember it? Yes, they do remember it. Uh, well, Harry's waving the hand, so I'll, I'll take that as a sort of a yes. Okay, so I will give this a go as well and just see if you like this. <clears throat> so Milo Mugokino means uh, my red apple, uh, in case you're wondering what the next what the title means. Milo Mukokino Roy Dova Meno Milo Mukokino Roy Dova Meno Yatime Maranes Ton Bikrameno Yatime Maranes Ton Bikrameno Πηγαίνω κι έρχομαι, μα δεν σε βρίσκω. Πηγαίνω κι έρχομαι, μα δεν σε βρίσκω. Βρίσκω την πόρτα σου, μα ανταλωμένη. Βρίσκω την πόρτα σου, μα ανταλωμένη. Τα παραστηδρούδια σου φεγκοβολούνε. Τα παραστηδρούδια σου φεγκοβολούνε. Ρώτω την πόρτα σου που πάει κυρά σου. Ρώτω την πόρτα σου που πάει κυρά σου. Κύρα δεν είναι εδώ, πάει στη βρύση. Κύρα δεν είναι εδώ, πάει στη βρύση. Πάει να πει νερό και να γιομίσει. Πάει να πει νερό και να γεμίσει. Right, that's as good as I can do by myself. Hope that's all right. Amazing, thank you. <clears throat> and thank you for dancing. That was lovely. Thank you. That made it all worthwhile, actually. So, so like, is this, uh, yes, it's getting through to Thank everyone. you, everyone. No problem. I'm glad you enjoyed it. Um, so that's, yeah, that's all I've really read. In case you're wondering uh, about the lyrics, there is an English translation here. So it is, um, my red apple colored like a pomegranate. Uh, why do you let me wither, uh, who am suffering bitterness? I go out and come, uh, but I do not find you. I find your door bolted. Your little windows are aglow. I'm asking of your door, where did your mistress go? As, not, as in an actual, uh, not a bad mistress, a good mistress, obviously. My mistress is not here. She went to the well. She went to drink water and to fill, um, and to fill her jug, you know, the water jug, effectively. Think about the old times. Um, so, one final thing I would say, if, you, if you're wondering why it sounded like I might be repeating myself for a little while, apparently this goes back to the times of uh, Ottoman occupation. And the Ottomans were very keen to try and kill off the Greek language and things like the songs and so forth. So, the only time that people were actually able to sing their songs were at uh, big events like weddings and christenings and so forth. So the way they found of continuing the music was to get everybody to repeat. So someone would sing the first line and then people would repeat. And that's apparently how they kept the songs going for, for 500 odd years of uh, Turkish occupation. 
So I just thought that might be a little fact. Um, uh, I'm, I'm sure it's true. I don't know 100% whether it's true, but I just thought, you, you know, that might be something interesting to throw in there before I finish. Thank you. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. I think this is how many... Oh, someone is clapping. <laughs> Um, Emma and Marius and Harry and uh -huh. everybody there. Um, <laughs> yeah, Newton. Yeah, I think that's how many people were able to keep their um, songs and identity in the end. Um, that, for me, for example, my family coming from Northwestern Greece and being part of a, a people who never had their country, but they had their identity and their own language. I think this is uh, quite interesting because uh, they kept it through songs and they kept it through their language. Um, I might even throw something of that um, in here uh, at the end. But in the meantime, anyone else has anything that they want to share with us musically? You're still thinking guys, because we want more of you as well. But while you're thinking, um, the past, you're still muted. Let me ask which one. Um, in the past few days, because it was the Pascal period, um, we kept thinking Christ is risen in all kinds of languages. Um, some of us were at church this morning, um, we're singing uh, Christ is Reason in, uh, I sang it today, I think in Romanian, and Greek and English. Um, but uh, Wana had something for us um, in Romanian. So I was talking to her the other day and we realized that we missed quite a lot the Katavasias, the, the Paschal Katavasias for the ones who don't know they are actually uh, sung during the matins, um, I think. Um, <laughs> uh, I, I say I think because there are some people here much more um, prepared than me to speak about Byzantine music. Uh, but uh, yeah, so they, they're singing during Orthros or matins. Uh, after um, after Pascha and probably up until um, Ascension, I think, if we can confirm. Okay. Uh, so uh, going to a more religious type of song um, of chant, I think I'll, uh, I'll give the floor to Wana to, to show us what she learned because many of us are studying Byzantine music nowadays, either in Romanian or in Greek. So it's good to... Um, uh, share it with um, with everyone. The Romanian was well, the Romanian ones. I actually missed because I wasn't. Uh, I, I usually attend the Greek church, uh, and they're quite nice. Um, so, Wana, tell us more about what you're going to sing. Uh, thank you, thank you, Alexandra, for um, doing this introduction for me because uh, my English is uh, quite bad in regards to um, church terms, let's say, and because I'm also new uh, in Celtic music. Uh, I'm learning in Romanian, so definitely I don't know, I would have not known to explain that better as you did um, for everyone. So yes, um, those are the Katavasias. Basically, in the, during the night of, uh, when we celebrate the resurrection of God, we have the matins before the liturgy. And basically, we, uh, uh, all the matins, um, contained um, during the matins, we sing the entire uh, canon of the resurrection. But after the whole, the um, uh, bright week, uh, during uh, Sunday matins, we only sing the Katavasias. And I think uh, most of you probably, uh, you know better than I know because I'm very new to it. But basically it's the first, um, a song of every uh, of every chant. You know, a canon has nine ch um, parts. Uh, actually, eight. One is missing. Yes. Uh, so I don't know why I accepted to do this, but I think I was enthusiasted by the idea that I um, I learned to sing uh, uh, first because I'm. Um, uh, I mean, I'm happy because uh, I wasn't able to sing. Not not even. Um, 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 uh, how do you say in English? Sorry, I'm not. 
uh, something like happy birthday to you yeah. things like that for me even happy birthday was really hard to sing um so during this pandemic year every day uh we gathered people on zoom and for half an hour we learned to sing uh Psartic music so i'm not sure if this will get um really nice it's my first time when i'm doing this and i think it won't get good at, uh, at all but i'm happy that someone is um willing to listen to me <laughs> just because i can go to um uh, to a church and to sing uh, with others in a choir uh so yeah i'm sorry for everything you will hear and it won't sound uh, really good but i will do my best to not um to show that the teacher I have during this year uh, was really good and did an amazing job with me. Okay. I will start with, um, with Christ is risen. And I already, I'm already nervous, so I might actually not sing actually. I will start and uh, then stop. Okay. Anane. Christos aum viad in mort, cum morte apre moarte colcun, si celor din mormântut viața dărui. Okay, so I survived. <laughs> That's good. Well done. Yeah. Uh, now I will uh, uh, sing the first two katavasiyas. They are eight katavasiyas. I won't sing uh, all of them. I only uh, will sing the first two. Uh, the first and the second one. Ananes. Ziua învierii popoară să ne luminăm Paștile Domnului, Paștile, că din moarte la viață și de pe pământ la cer, Hristos Dumnezeu ne-a trecut pre noi. Cei ce cântăm cântare de biruință, Venit să bem băutură nouă, nu din piatră starpă făcută cu minuni, ci din izvorul stricăciunii, din Hristos cel ce a izvorât din mormânt, întru care le ne întărim. Maybe I will go with the third one. Well done. <laughs> I start to like it, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> La Dumnezeiasca strajă de Dumnezeu, grăitorul la vacum, să stea împreună cu noi și să arate pe îngerul cel purtător de lumină, care le a grăit cu mare glas. Astăzi este mântuirea lumii, că a înviat Hristos ca cel tot puternic. Thank you. So now I will go to, um, to Îngerul Astigat. Um, the angel i don't know how to how the angel cried the angel cried yes the axion um and um, um this is the axion that we sing during the period before pascha and resurrection so instead of uh cuvina we sing uh, uh this Anane, îngerul a strigat că trecea plină de daruri, curată fecioară bucurăte, și iară zic bucurăte că fiul tău a înviat a treia zi din groapă. 
Luminează-te, luminează-te, noule Ierusalime, că slava Domnului peste tine a răsărit. Saltă acum și te bucură, Sioane, iar tu curată născătoare de Dumnezeu, veselește-te pentru învierea celui născut al tău. And the last one. <laughs> Uh, I don't know how you say uh, in English. Maybe Alexander can help as well. Luminanda, do we have Putrupula? Uh, yeah, exapostilaria is in Greek. So for the ones who know that, I don't think they found a, tr uh, a translation in um, uh, English. But um, yeah, it's exapostilaria for the connoisseur. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, thank you very much, Alexander, for help. Na na cu trupul adormit ca un muritor împărate și doamne a treia zi ai învia Pe Adam din stricăciune ridicând și moartea pierzându-o, Paștile nestricăciunii, de Sorry, actually, if my teacher would have listened to this, he would have not been very happy. <laughs> well, he's not here, but it was it was really great to be able to hear that again. I've, I've uh, honestly, it was two years ago when I last been during the pastoral time um, in Armenian church. So thank you for sharing this with us. <laughs> Yulia says beautiful. Thank you. Thank you very much. Can I say as well, Ioana, I've spent many years, I, I started learning band time music when I was about nine years old. Um, so you're starting at a later time. So don't be so harsh on yourself first, I'm just going to say. Um, and the other thing I want to say is I've sung in many a Byzantine choir next to many uh, people. And I've been next to many ladies who thought they could scream, but made the sound akin to a screaming cat. So, and you're not one of them. And they thought they were all absolutely wonderful. You at least have the humility to, and you know, you have the love for them. You want to, you want to go on. So don't be harsh on yourself. You've actually got quite a good gift. Just, just carry on plugging away. As I said, don't, don't beat yourself down. You did very well. All right. Thank you. Thank you for your encouragement and your nice words. Thanks. Welcome. Thank you. Who wants to sing some crisis reason in their languages? Because we heard Duana singing Romanian, so we can continue. I think the Christ is risen. I can do it again well, one time if you like, but it's uh, I'd like someone else to do it if they want to. Open the floor, Andy. Maybe then Emma and Harry will do a version. I think they know it in quite a few languages. A Emma, you must know it in about five, six languages, surely, from what I remember. Oh, I got that wrong. Can, we, can, um, we can sing in, in English, uh, Greek. Greek, French. Yeah. Uh, we had the Georgian before. Yes. Um, I can't remember it in Arabic. I, I, I can't remember the words quite. Russian? I don't remember. Russian. Russian, but someone's Russian here, right? Or speak. We sing some things Russian. Um, we do. I think Sardiri said this. Sardiri, did you have your hand up as well? Um, unmute yourself. You can unmute. Yeah, of course. Uh, I would say Tuxos Anesi is Greek, but uh, <laughs> maybe there are there are many Greeks. That I don't know. No. Can I sing? No, no. Well, we can sing. I think 
we could sing it even if it's Greek, for example. I think we can each of us can each sing Christos Anesti because it's a it's a time of resurrection, and uh, not for not in terms of competition, but just in terms of us coming together and celebrating the uh, the resurrection. So uh, we're here to obviously celebrate together and have a good time. So let, let's all let's do all do what we can. So uh, Emma. Emma, Harry, Mario, I, uh, as I said, I, I know, remember you do, you can do it lots of languages. So um, I'm happy for you to have the floor for this and take this away. And what oh, I love the floor. Uh, yeah, yeah, actually, Harry, dig up the floor and take it with you. And it, it's all yours. <laughs> all right. Christ is risen from the dead. Trampling on the Biden and upon those in the tombs, bestowing lies, restores what's blessed. It's met me, met you, met for grab. It's who she will grab, yes, she will grab. Thank you. Thank you. I'll try to give you a flavor of the Christ is Risen in uh, Black language or Armanashti for those who haven't listened to it yet. Yeah. Some of you already have. As you can see, it's a language between Latin and Greek. Um, and um, you can, some of the Romanians maybe can hear some words similar to Romanian, yeah. some of the Greeks can hear words um, similar to, to the Greek language. So there we go. We were born some, somewhere in the Northwestern Greece, Sepirus area, and we are scattered around the Balkans.